Well, hey, fire signs, how you guys doing today? Welcome in. This is your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus reading, Sag, Aries, Leo. For you, let's see where we go. Let's see where we go. If you're looking for the individual Zodiac readings, you can find them on Patreon. There's a link below if you want to join up there. You get all 12, so you might want to consider that. Just saying. <laughs> Hope you're doing great today. Let's see where we go here. Aries, Leo, Sag, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Whoopsie. Feel, feel free to uh, swap around the energies as always. I could be talking to a cross watcher. So just take whatever resonates for you, whatever's helpful. All right, let's see where we go here. Okay. Ah, Voyage of the Heart. Love flows through you and to you. All right, that's really weird. Voyage of the Heart. I only have one deck. <laughs> one of these decks. I only have one of these decks. Where did that come from? Discovering truth. Okay. In all my years of doing tarot, I have never seen that. I usually, a lot of times you see like, if I have like right here, I have, um, two of these decks, I have two of these green decks. This is the dreaming way tarot. And so sometimes if I reach for a deck and I'm messing up the decks then I have two, I don't have two of these decks. Is that a little emphasis? <laughs> Everything's coming through the heart chakra, people. Love, love. Even Steven. Back and forth. It's even on both sides. Love is love. Love. You stand in the light of truth. This is very much about sharing the truth of love. Your truth. Speaking in authenticity, speaking to the other person, they speak it back to you. <clears throat> get what you give. Most definitely, you get what you give. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, let's see where we go here. Okay. Wow, That's, that blows my mind, it really does. Justice underneath, the Libra energy there. Let's see where we go. First card out, Cancerian, water sign. I've seen this a lot. There's a water sign around fire, definitely. Three of Swords, Page of Pentacles, Ten of Swords. Somebody coming back from the past that you guys had a breakup and it was done, 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 done. There is no way on earth you thought this was ever coming back from the dead, okay? Ten of Swords, Devil Energy, Eight of Wands, Six of Swords, Queen of Pentacles. Could be dealing with a Capricorn, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Cancer, or Libra. Most likely a Capricorn, Libra, Cancer. Okay, most likely one of those three. So please clarify the devil energy here for me. This person has learned something new. Knight of Wands, Empress, Knight of Cups. This person has learned to not be a player anymore. That's what ended that relationship. Page of Wands, World. Yes, okay. This person was very immature. That's over. Okay, that's over. This person sees the error of their ways now moving in through their heart chakra. This could be you or this could be them, but I feel like um, this person was very selfish, almost to the point of, uh, you know, paying attention to their own pain, paying attention to their own needs, you know, and now they've learned something new. That This person likely had a heart chakra awakening and it was very painful. Very painful for them because what they thought they were doing I'll just be honest with you here. <laughs> well, that's what we do here. Um, what they thought was love was not love. In the past, what they thought they were showing people wasn't love. It was like, it wasn't that they were doing something that um, 
ha ha ha, I'm getting away with this. Like, look at how little I'm giving and look at how much I'm getting and ha ha ha. It was that they really thought that that's what, what love was. So they were like, I don't understand. You're asking me what? You're asking me to, to change something. I think this is what love is. It wasn't. It wasn't. Okay. Um, this happened to them in their childhood, I think. I think they might have had a very selfish uh, parent. One of their parents might have been very selfish. And so that's what they were emulating. That's what they aligned with. Because it really did feel so good when that parent showered some love on them. It was very erratic. Okay? This person was had a parent that was very erratic, dipping in and out of their life. Could have been their mother, but it could have been their father too. It wasn't, you know. Um, somebody who was, you know not really showing love to them, but that's what they thought was love. And now Knight of Cups, it's almost like the, the heart chakra awakening. They're like, oh, this is what love is. Compassion, right? Compassion, high vibration, giving, receiving, receiving. If you don't receive love, that's as selfish as not giving. People who don't, you know, no, I just give, I just give. It like changes the balance of power in a relationship and turns it into a power struggle. So this is about learning something new. I feel like they might have learned something new. This could be you, but this feels like another person to me that they've learned something and are coming back around to you. Did you hear that little Charlie? Ooh, ooh, growling. Ooh. I'm growling. Ooh. So something had ended with this, and I feel like um, you might have felt that this person was either a karmic or someone who was a catalyst or something like that. I feel like you were a catalyst for them, fire sign, for them to realize what they were doing, that they weren't really being loving. Okay, and so there's going to be a, there's going to be a conversation. And I do feel like there's something uh, on the horizon that's much more nurturing and loving. Um, I do feel like the, dis the discovering truth part is like, you know, when I say to you f fairness, okay, because we have the Libra energy here. When I say to you fairness. We might all, each one of us, have a different definition of what fair is. We might have a different definition of what love is. And so when we use words, it's kind of important, and I think extremely important as it relates to this connection, that you identify and you define your terms. So the communication needs to get a lot more clear and I feel like this person is coming from a new place now. I feel like what, what they thought was love wasn't it being experienced either by you or by other people that they were dealing with as love. And I think they're going to say to you, you know, I really thought I was being loving. I really did. But now I see. Now I see that it wasn't loving. It was selfish. Or it was... Um, I was, you know, out of whack here. I was a little askew. All right, so I'm going to continue on with this and see where we go. I do see, um, I see a lot here. I see Libra. I see Libra. I see Cancer. I see Capricorn. So we'll take a look at those in the extended. Taurus. Okay. Taurus, Libra, Capricorn, Cancer. We'll take a look at those. Okay. I'm going to continue on with this reading. Let's see where we go. All right. And it's some advice for you. Link is below for you. I'll see you.